For people with very deep skin pores, I look at this much more holistically, and I'll tell you kind of the algorithm that we follow for this. The first question we ask is where are the pores coming from? And again, allergies, skin allergies, and hypersensitivity are a key factor in sebaceous or um, uh, inflammation of the sebaceous glands, which tends to lead to more porous skin. So taking a more functional medical approach to this problem, I think will help you and getting tested for a variety of especially food allergies, I think could be the first step that I would take in a case like yours. Secondly, I have found that certain types of um, recurrent treatments are very effective for pores, more than just doing one or two CO2 lasers, where again, the fractional lasers can help for a period of time, but then the pores tend to recur. My favorite laser for cases like this is something called the Adva light. The Adva uses <clears throat> a yellow light or 589 laser to really remove the dead skin and also the bacteria that's causing a lot of the um, surface inflammation that can lead to the porosity. And then we use the second component, the 1319 laser, to really shrink the pores. Using the Adva in sequence on your skin, especially dealing with issues of maybe food, or environmental hypersensitivity, I think will help you. I think continually doing ablative lasers will have a limiting effect on your skin long-term.